LA good vibes. Find the vehicle. After one day, I found the right one. A Terra 2009 Fleetwood, 36 feet. The outward appearance, classic. However, what a surprise when I stepped into it. It was dirty, very dirty. In fact, almost spoiled. Probably the previous owner had dogs, cats, or wild animals. The kitchen was classic, basic, but most of all, there was space. I was already imagining where and how to do the recording studio. I immediately loved the bedrooms at the back in the main room. They were perfect for doing a studio. Instead of the bed, we would put two bunk beds. Easy. There were some drawers where we could save everything easily, storing music instruments. Above all, I was going to get rid of the generator. It makes noise, stinks, and it's heavy. We had enough work. Headlights to change, scratches everywhere. Also, we had to think about how to clean the roof. There could be nothing left on the roof to be able to install the solar panels. We had to remove everything. Enough waterproofing work with water leaks coming from the ceiling of the blinds. Quite a few other jobs to envision. Between them, understand why there was an oil leak under the vehicle. Check the condition of the engine. Check why there were loose wires. And above all, a lot of cleaning. Remove the carcasses of birds above the kitchen. In addition to review why there was mouse droppings everywhere. Even in the engine. Everything ready? Everybody ready? Yep. Oui. Oui. <laughs> all that remained was to do a driving test. To see if I felt good with that kind of vehicle. Luckily, I did my first lap in California. However, it was in the rain. I was far from comfortable when I hit the highway, for several reasons. First, because it is an imposing vehicle. The road was under construction. It was raining. And to top it off, there was a police car right behind me. I had then a slight pressure during the first miles traveled with this new ship. I was determined. It was a good one, though. It was very expensive, $55,000. I then proposed $30,000, and finally we agreed to the sum of $33,000. I became an owner. We had to start working then to modify everything. Two essential things before starting the first jobs. To start with, an oil change. Charles' specialty. We leave it to him then. Oh, Charles. Yes. Because in a few hours, we would go to Arizona. Why? Because it was the second essential thing before we start the work. I wanted to meet an engineer, an expert in solar products and caravans. He's been living off the grid for three years now, with his wife living on a bus. He sold his house. I asked him to help me and explain how does it work. He was very happy to meet me. Then we did six to eight hours on the road for the next morning. 